Well, I started uh, doing the countersink on it, and then I realized, oh, uh, you know, I should probably get rid of the burr. Uh, and then I realized after I got a bunch of these done where I sanded down both sides to get the burr off, uh, then it dawned on me, it's like, oh, I should probably do all the finished sanding before I start welding these because, you know, to to put just to, to soften the edge up there just a little bit, uh, that's going to be a whole lot easier to do it now than after it's welded together as a, as a final part. So that's what I'm doing, and it's out of this box into that one. Got a box of like 80 something of these left to do, and I, I still have to chamfer one side for the uh, welding. So I've got everything set up here. I'm, I'm using a, uh, I just got these. I think I got them through Shars. Yep. A set of three countersinks, three different sizes. I think this is the small one, and it goes just big enough. The other option was to uh, do it with the bigger one here. I'm still using basically the same setup here. That's still zeroed over the same spot. The only uh, difference here is now this this takes almost as long as the drilling. I'll run it down in there. I'll spray more oil and stuff like that. Uh, but I'm using my Z DRO, my little uh, caliper-based DRO, to uh, tell me how far down I'm going. So that way they turn out fairly predictable. And they don't have to be perfect because that's going to get all welded in and then ground back off, basically. So as long as they come out looking close. After that... We need to punch the holes in here, and then these parts, I believe, are basically done until it's time to uh, weld them onto the other brackets. So I put a piece of aluminum over here on this side. Yeah, okay, you can see that. And that's because putting this piece with the hard edges from the laser cutting up against the two hard jaws, when it wanted to start wobbling around, it wouldn't really grab this, and this would really start wobbling. So that is to help get some extra bite there. Uh, I've got a vice stop in there so I can put the piece in repeatedly. Clamp it down.